So tell us about how you actually became an artist. What drew you to art and how did you kind of find that as your career or calling? Yeah, that that's interesting and involves Karen, my sister. Um, I, I think I think you're born an artist for a lot of people. Mm. I mean, some come to it later, but for me, I, I was always an artist. It's all I ever really wanted to do. And I was in the fashion business and... Karen, I was living in Los Angeles and Karen had come out and we were chatting and I had said to her, the only thing I ever really wanted to do was be an artist. And back in London, she had a kids wear company and basically she was paying someone a lot of money to do all the artwork. And I said, I could do that. And she said, but can you? I said, I think I can. And I did. And basically that's what I've done for the rest, you know, all the remaining years. I've been an artist. So were you designing like the graphics for the uh, clothing or were you designing more kind of towards the campaigns? And, and N- no, it, was, it wasn't that sort of highfalutin or whatever is mm-hmm. that. We were, Karen was making kids clothes and she had licenses with uh, different companies and I would do the artwork. Oh, got it. Well, that's really nice. And obviously that connection with the children and the art, you know, yeah, Which true, one? true. So you like to paint kind of places and people, I think, from your art. You know, what places do you like to paint and what kind of drew you to those certain places? And also there's figures, you know, and people in the artwork. Are they real people or are they more imagined? You know, I've come to it. I, said, I don't think I've got a great imagination. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I see people. I... I um. You know, wherever I am, you know, I, I'm just, it's almost like an attraction. They'll be, and, and I don't always like the best looking people because they're, to me, they're more gritty, they're more soulful. <laughs> or the most interesting. The most interesting. Thank you. I'll, I'm going to rephrase that one. <laughs> so, yeah, so I look for like interesting people, people that got like life on them. Yes. Because I know they have a story. Yes. And it always makes you wonder, you know, what the story is. You know, people have that kind of, game where they think and look on people on the street and think what would their story be i love that I mean, yeah. and the worst part is when you find out the story it's not the worst part it's <laughs> the best and the worst i very rarely find out the story but when you do they're never ever ever what you would imagine what you think yeah and everyone has a story 